can't believe we're getting married. Shall I compare thee to a summer's day? Thou art hot. It's almost the perfect fairy tale. Because everything always goes your way, doesn't it? Oh, bring me my blood, Dennis. <laughs> Good at this job, Sid. I deserve to be higher up the ladder. No, he's a bad guy. Your actions have consequences for my operation. And I'm a man who gets angry when things don't run smoothly. Mitchell's wedding is wrong. Why can't you just see past your beliefs for one day? Some people say, live your life like there's no tomorrow. I say, live life like there's no yesterday. It's him or me. I'll give you anything you ask for. Put your eyes back in. Are you better? What's the worst that could possibly happen? Monster! Yeah! Ah, I'm almost more than Diane can handle. Ooh. I am done with running away. That's way more than normal. He said if you mess up, there'll be consequences. I'm scared, Jules. You get everything! You're not my family, and you never will be. Oh, wait till you get a load of Tony 2.0. I'm better. We're back, Nick. <laughs> Hollyoaks is back in production, and I am so happy. I'll tell you what, Jenna, I've never been so excited to get these. And what an autumn we've got lined up for you guys. All in time for Hollyoaks' 25th birthday in October. To celebrate this incredible milestone, we're going to spend the next five weeks looking back at five of the best weeks of Hollyoaks ever. And we are kicking off with the first five years, 1995 to 2000. And the week we've chosen features the show's first ever bad boy villain, Rob Harfon, and the show's first ever huge stunt. So, it's 1999, it's Tony's best mate Kurt Benson's funeral, and Rob decides to show his sympathies by kidnapping Kurt's little sister Lucy and whisking her off to a remote location. And a young, very fresh-faced Tony. Runs to the rescue with Ruth and Lewis, only to be caught in Rob's evil trap. That's when you thought it was safe. <laughs> I cannot wait for this. Yeah, me too. Elsewhere in the episode, Max doesn't know how to tell his family that Cindy's new boyfriend, Sean, might be a danger to little Holly. Even if my mum did listen, which she won't. So keep on at her. Eventually she'll have to listen. What's the matter with you? You said you were going to do it. Look, you don't know what it's like in my house. So sit back, get comfy, and join us as we watch Hollyoaks at 25. <laughs>